Yeah, so KP and I first met seven years ago. I first met Lucy when we went to Svalbard seven years ago. And we haven't really been on an extreme adventure since. And so in December this year, we drank a large bottle of wine and decided we needed to make a pinky promise. Now we're in the Arctic two months later. Okay, Pete's just spraying the fridge for the last bits. Oh, salt. Lucy getting ready for the night in the airport. So we thought we were going to be the only ones sleeping in the airport. Turns out every single person who wants to go skiing in Norway doesn't want to pay for a hotel. It brings their sleeping bag and sits on us. <laughs> We're not alone. left yesterday and we had to overnight it in our sleep, um, in our sleeping bags and uh, on the floor of the airport and we've taken a car and a skidoo to get to a lodge in the middle of nowhere and we've spent the day packing our box and testing out the, the stoves and ninjaing our turn and doing all the admin jobs and now we're having some dinner, having some tea considering life a little bit. <laughs> Tomorrow we head off and the weather is looking pretty breezy and the landscape will be very barren so it could get very cold so I think it may be face mask and goggle time. So yeah, last night in the warmth for a little bit and can't wait to get out in that wilderness. Here we have Grandma Lucy doing a little bit of sewing by the fire. Time you'll ever see it. Oh, it was really bad. It's not, it wasn't even worth doing. <laughs> She's wearing all of her Arctic gear, and we're currently inside with the fire on. <laughs> is having a snack break in the Arctic. Yeah, getting my big mittens on. She's got cold hands. I can't see <laughs> And we are on the first day. We have just stopped. And it's quite cold. <laughs> so she's got the world's like <laughs> largest bits going on. <laughs> My five layers. What's yet. today been like? Today has been fantastic. Absolutely stunningly beautiful. The sun has never really risen properly the whole day. So it's just been like sunset or sunrise the whole time. The, the sky has been glowing and all the clouds have been like pink. Um, um, hoping to get into the temp pretty soon and warm up. It's been a cold day. Colder than we thought, hasn't it? Very cold. <laughs> I've never worn three layers on my legs and then skied and still not been overly warm. It is pitch black but it's not actually that late at all. It's only 7pm but screw that we're going to bed. Good night. Day two, getting ready for our next ski. We were cosy. Can you tell? <laughs> Excuse me. That was very rolling around. <laughs> Oh my god, that's what I dreamed about. Oh, a really obese woman. <laughs> Maybe it was a metaphor for my life now. <laughs> Considering we're about to eat 700 calories for breakfast. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm talking about. 
People ask, why, why do you come to the Arctic? This is why. We're in the tent and Lucy is sharing her double-decker with me, which is very kind. Thank you very much. <laughs> what are you doing, Lucy? I'm warming up. <laughs> Time to eat. It's time to it's eat. Time. It's time. 15 minutes of waiting. The longest 10 minutes of my life. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? I'm trying to defrost all the ice in my Nalgene. It's 7.30 in the morning and what are we about to do, Lucy? Gonna cross big empty space and it's going to take a long time but we're going to do it and we're going to camp the other side. <laughs> that's and the plan. Pardon? I said that's the plan. Oh we're going to do it. We are going to do it. We have to. We've got up very early so that we don't have to camp in the middle of an open plateau. We've arrived at a hut thought we were going to be cosy and warm somewhere, but no one's here. So instead, Lucy the machine is digging us a hole to sleep in, because the snow is so powdery. Lucy, put, pop your leg like on the top and show us what the problem is. Oh! oh. <laughs> There's nothing more I love better than pulling a bog while skiing. It surprisingly feels great. Kofi's behind. And, yeah, going through a lovely wooded area. And uh, not having to cover our faces the whole time because it's much warmer today. And we are flying today, aren't we, Kofi? We sure are. We are flying. Just hitchhiked half the way, haven't we? Yeah, minus now it's snack time. <laughs> minus 20 while we wait for our next lift. Time to get the uh, hitchhiking dance on. <laughs> yeah, it does take a dance to get a hitch. <laughs> She's doing the hitchhiking dance. Turned in from that. 